Today's date is June 20th, 2016. I'm at 556 Meadowbrook televising a sanitary sewer line from the 6 inch cleaning out in front of the house. I ran the camera towards the house right here looking at the cast iron where it meets up with the clay. I'll go in the quarters and come back. Here you see some tree roots in the line. Oh, you've got a couple cracks in the pipe. Here's some more minor roots. A slight belly in a line right here is where you approach the trap. The trap itself had a little bit of a, a grease built up on top. Now back in the riser, try to run the camera through the trap and go out towards the bank. We're through the trap, we're just underwater still. I think we just went into the main, just the lens is real dirty. Try to get it cleaned off. I'm gonna pause the video for right now, get some more water going, see if we can get this cleaned off. Got the camera through the line right now, we're looking down at MSD's main. There's a piece of uh, clay pipe that's down in the main I pushed out. There's another piece that's still in the sewer line. I cannot get the camera to push it out. The camera keeps jumping over it. I'll go on and record as I come back. All right here, we're leaving a liner around outside of the clay. Some minor roots. Right here's the other piece of pipe. The uh, vent riser is badly damaged. I believe these pieces of pipe came from the vent riser. I said I was able to push out one piece uh, similar in size to this one, but actually the camera just keeps jumping over this here. If you even try to pull it back by uh, coming backwards with it, and uh, I just simply can't move it. I'm going to come back into a belly again as we get closer to the trap. Now back out of the line. I'll clean the lens off so we can show the uh, damage to the vent riser. Here you see the riser is uh, broken. 
you get past, you can see some uh, heavy cracking going on. Right here, the crack sand. Let's zero this out and try to get an idea how far down it's got to go. So roughly four or five foot's got to come out. Because of this damage, I don't want to try to run a cable line because I'm afraid of knocking more pieces of the uh, riser down into the trap. Once the riser is repaired, I would recommend uh, cabling out the sewer line, try to see if we can get that piece of pipe out, and also to clear out the roots going upstream. This now concludes the videotaping of this sewer.